All right, guys, this is the game. Um, I already started it up a little bit. I just wanted to uh, make sure everything works. And uh, turns out my controller doesn't. So we're going to be playing on mouse and keyboard. Oh, let's get into it. I'm so excited, dude. Ah, I'm so excited. Do you have those moments that just stick out in your mind? Yes. Those ones that just stay with you forever. Absolutely. When I was a kid, I was told, you are what you do. So choose wisely. And I tried to choose doctor. But that didn't take. I can still hear him. You know, this, this just isn't for you. But I knew what they meant. This just isn't you. That's probably not a problem for you, is it, buddy? Chomper, world's best pup and friend. Chaser of squirrels, smeller of city streets, and chewer of literally everything. Nice. <laughs> See, you know exactly who you are. Oh, I wish I could say the same. I probably should have had a backup plan, huh? Guess I haven't exactly made the best decisions lately. <laughs> Except for adopting you, of course. Without you, I'd be pretty lost. And I sure as hell wouldn't be out on this road in the middle of nowhere, Alaska. But we needed a fresh start, and I've dreamed of dog sledding since I was a kid. Margo made the races sound incredible. Margo? Who's Margo? How you've dragged me up and down the streets of San Francisco, I think you have dog racing dreams too. <laughs> well, let's go assemble us a team, huh, Chomper? We need four more pups to start training. Right. Oh, hey, we just passed mile marker 32. 32. So the ad said that just after the mile marker, there would be a kennel with a dog sledding veteran we could adopt. Figure we can check out the pup, maybe add some experience to our team. What do you think? Oh, shit. Um, especially I, I'm selecting a response to myself. It's, we need someone who can match our drive. I'm tired of people thinking we can't cut it. Damn right. Dear God, your eyes are blue. Oh, are Lee, the they are. Hilton? And you don't seem to miss a thing. You're keeping a constant watch. I bet you know everything. Looks like an owl. Oh, huh? oh boy. You're supposed to be retired, but it sounds like you've been keeping tabs on the pups and leading their training runs. I'll leave you to retirement. I know a pup that would love to have you around. So, meet Chomper. Hey, Chomps, could you stop nibbling on your paw and say hello? You got like a cold <laughs> fire in those eyes. People shouldn't give up on you so quickly. <clears throat> but I guess some people get obsessed with crushing the competition and they don't see the value of a well-rounded team. We can't all be speedsters or beasts. Sometimes you need a pup who can let you know when you're steering the team into trouble. Or a moose. <laughs> I hear moose are more threatening than bears. Is that true? I'm going to take that growl as a yes. We're out here to become a real dog musher and, you know, hopefully one day win a race or two. How's that sound? We've got to prove we can hack it out there. We need to find out what we're made of. Sometimes you just need a new challenge. Yeah, we need to find out what we're made of. Or... Crew, we can hack it out there. Yeah. It's just us in the world. We own our fate here. We're glad to have you, Stilton. I don't know what the ride is going to be like, but... We're definitely going to have an adventure. It's just a few more miles to our next stop. We're looking for three more pups to fill out our team and help us get to our new home. Yes, sir. Barkley. Oh, you're not a small fella, are you? They said you were big, but you're gonna make Chomper look like he was mixed with a corgi. You're actually kind of intimidating. Okay, it sounds like you've gotten into a few fights out there in the wilderness, and that you always stuck by your musher's side, but they were afraid you would jump into a fight you couldn't win. But now you've become restless, being stuck back in the kennel, howling at night for the wild you can't get to. 
Well, we're hopefully going to have a nice training run out to a new home. We'll see plenty of wild things, I'm sure. And I'd like to avoid the fights I can't win, too. I think this could be good. For both of us. Agreed. All right. What do you think? Dude, this is definitely a, 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 a pop we need, baby. He's a he's badass. He's going to be legit clapping. I'm not really sure why they call you Barkley. You haven't made a single sound since I met you. Should we give you a new name? Something that reflects your quiet nature? Slippers snoozers. I don't want any of these. I like Barkley. I mean, slip. Uh, who the fuck knows? Snoozer. snoozer Resident snoozer. A better fit. God damn it. Oh. Okay, so uh, not quiet. Just one to pick your moments. I will make sure to listen. So Thank let's God. Barkley then. Hmm. Oh, this is adorable. Sure you based on your skills, or just because I can't pass up a pup. But I am very excited about this team we've put together. We have six stops to go, and we only need to adopt two more dogs. Oh, six stops. Shit. All right. Oh, he's all black. Uh, Slayer. Slayer. Dude, replace this one with Barkley. I'm just gonna come a little closer to get a good look at ya. Never mind, I will stay right here. How does that sound? Looks like you might need some time to get to know me. I get it, your family did say you're a bit skittish. Are you really afraid of balloons? Yeah, I've got some weird fears too. I mean, they're totally rational. I think it's just good sense to be afraid of manhole covers. You can fall in, bad stuff could come out. That's clearly the beginning of the end. Okay, well, that's not exactly why I moved out here. But I don't think I have to worry about manhole covers anymore. And it sounds like you're very fast. I suppose knowing when and how to escape when you're afraid of everything is a perfectly fine skill. Yeah, I feel like he might kind of ruin our pack. I feel like he's the type of dog who, who would get into a fight with another dog. I can't say for sure I know what's going to happen on this trip to the cabin. Sounds like it should be pretty straightforward, but I know nothing is. So we'll just try to follow what we think is right. Well, Slayer, what do you think? Now he seems like he doesn't want to stay. I mean, come with us. I'm keep no. Settled, I'll come back for you. No, no, no. Slayer. no shot, no shot. I feel like it would just ruin our things, mess it up for us. Hey, so far so good. Two pups out of the three stops is a great start. We only need to adopt two more dogs, and we have five more stops. I think yes. Be okay. Yes, sir. Noodle. Noodle, huh? <laughs> I can see that. I said running alone wasn't enough for you. You were looking for some kind of challenge and a musher who would listen to you too. Well, I don't really know what I'm doing, so uh, having some help out there might be nice. Are you ready for the retired life? Or are you just waiting for someone to believe in you again? Just know that I still have to make the calls and try to do what's best for us. Will that work for you? I don't think Noodle's it, guys. I don't think Noodle's it. We're looking for a legit clapping We're gang of life. wolves. We have to be a little bit picky. I want to make sure we have a well-rounded team. So we've got four more stops to find our last two pups. Yep. That should work. Yep. Bodega. Uh, did you move your house here? I don't have any snacks, Bodega. Why didn't I bring snacks? They said he's been eating them out of house and home. Well, hmm. I feel like this will make the game a little harder having him because he, he apparently likes to eat a lot. <laughs> he has free food uh, bins there. Um, he's cool. He has two different eyes. We're yeah, taking him. I think he'll be a great addition to the team. Let's get it. One more dog. Yeah, no, I 
barely have enough food for all of us, but that's part of the adventure, right? We're gonna find our food. We're gonna live off the land. Just imagine it. We're going to have the heaviest sled. We'll catch what we need when we need it. We'll catch we'll what. Live a life yep. It's not wasteful. We'll be in control of everything and only take what we need when we need it. We'll keep your belly from grumbling and you can help carry us all home. We only have to worry about ourselves out here. A big reset button for all of us. We get to start something new. Become someone new. I feel like I'll like Wilderness Me. She believes in herself. At least she does right now. And I believe in you, Bodega. That's why you're part of the team. Yes, We're sir. A complete pack. Only one more pup and the team is done, and we still have three more to meet. Oh, this is going to be a hard decision. I wonder if we can go through all of these free and. Hey, uh, Where are is you? Is he going to jump out from some snow pile? <laughs> the Gazalia. You know you have a house right there. You don't have to be in the snow. Right. Home is where you make it, huh, Iggy? That's adorable. Oh, are you just a big old snowball? Big, fluffy, loud. <laughs> You're a lovely pup. But you no, seem no happy shot. Here. Take care, pal. I, I want, like, I mean, if not, if the other ones aren't going to be that great either, we might go back for her if we can. Team. Okay. We've got a few more stops left, and we only need one more pup. I know we'll find the right one. I wonder if we can go back and choose Iggy or Slayer. Hey, girl. And Are you Finn? Quite the uh, collection you've gathered here. Are these all things you found? They said you're pretty good with your nose. You tend to follow that more than anything else. Sometimes that led you to good things. Sometimes it led you to This skunks. is really good. You got tired of skunks, huh? Well, I don't really know my way out there. Uh, there's one dog left. More than just the trail. And while you might not be the best at running, it'd be great to have some help to know what to do. There's a lot I don't know about the Alaskan bush. And it's probably important yep. that I try to recognize that I don't know what I don't know. <laughs> okay, Finn. Seems like we could use a smart dog with a nose for the trail on our team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love to have you, Finn. That sounds like a great... I, I don't think I made a single wrong choice. Maybe Slayer over the other, whatever. I'd like to introduce you all to Finn. Finn comes to us, well, from the Alaskan bush, just like many of you do, <laughs> except for you, Chomper. Finn is joining us from a family from way out here. So, Finn, you like collecting things, huh? Chomper's the same. Every morning I wake up and he's piled all my shoes in my bed and is using them as a pillow. It's probably not quite the same. Your family said no. you never come back in from walks. You're always yearning to discover more out there, but you had a tendency to not know when you should stop and take a break. You just push and find yourself too tired to get back easily. That sounds like we'll have the right kind of adventures then. We're gonna keep going and rest along the way to, well, wherever. We're going to prove we belong out here. We're going to find our place in nature. We'll see what nature has in I store don't know for us. It's gonna be out there. I know what I've read and what's likely to happen, but if the past few years have taught me anything, it's that I can only plan to be surprised and do my best to adapt to what's in front of me. We'll follow you to the surprises we need, because we all know we'll need food once we set up our new spot. Well, you ready? Jumper, you approve? We're happy to have you, Finn. Oh, you're right. <laughs> We're nearly at the next stop. Thanks. You mind if I give you a pet? <laughs> okay, well, that's pretty good. Maybe we'll get to a pet eventually, but I will accept a cautious sniff. Nice. Hey, Chomper, you have to take it slow too, okay? She's not ready for you, your lack of personal boundaries. <laughs> I can't believe it. We're really about to do this. We've got an incredible team here, and all that's left for us is to head out to our new home. Did we get to meet the final dog or no? I don't think we did. Timberline Studios. Red Lantern. I'm so excited. I can't believe we made it to Alaska, Chomper. 
Margo said to travel to the end of the road and then hop on the sled and travel a few days more. We'd know her cabin more. by the red lantern hanging by the door. Nice. And she gave us this map. It's uh, not as helpful as I'd like. No. But it'll get us there. We just have to pick our macaroni and cheese on a menu. So you're going to have to take the lead. It's a lot of responsibility looking out for a team, but I think you're ready for it. You ready to find our oh, home? Oh, no. Who is that? <laughs> yeah. Who's that one rolling around? What right. do I choose? Let's make sure we have what we need. We've got our team. Mm -hmm. Barkley, Finn, Stilton, Bodega. And the sled is all ready to go. Oh, we shit. Essentials to get us started, but we're going to have to live off the land once we get to our cabin, so we might as well start training for that now, too, right? True, true. Oh, there's our inventory. This is the raw meat. Mm -hmm. You pups can handle the uncooked raw and cold food. The kind we'll also find on the trail. But I'm going to have to cook that up if I don't want to freeze my insides. True. Hypothermia is not something I'm really looking to try. Me neither. We'll be able to set up camp once we get properly out on the trail. I scrounged up this old gun and a couple of bullets. Just in case. So we'll make do with what we have. We can use them to hunt or keep them around in case we need to protect ourselves. It is the wilderness, after all. You know, bears, moose, wolves, skunks. Oh, huh? and most importantly, we've got one med pack. I should be able to bandage us up if something happens. Yep. Nice. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess we should start. <laughs> Why are they frozen? <laughs> Mushan, let's go on, on way. way. Well, that doesn't sound right, but hey, it worked. Let's Did make it? it our own. <laughs> oh, it's amazing! Oh, you barely control him. <laughs> oh, this is lit. Turn. Ah! Oh, Lee. Oh, the trailer will run into encounters. Encounters have risk, but also bring rewards. You won't survive without exploring, but going into encounters costs hunger. Cool. This is your hunger meter. If your hunger meter is empty, you need to eat soon or risk losing your current run. Yikes. I don't think I'm supposed to be going here. No, Chomper, I don't think you can jump that high. <laughs> Chase it and leave it alone. Bumps. Ignore it. Is, is this anything? It's your dog's energy meter. Crossing a trail marker costs one energy. Cool. These are examples of trail markers. Trail markers. Your run will end if you cross a trail marker when either your hunger meter or the dog's energy meter is empty. Cool. I think I'm going the wrong way here. Yeah, we need to turn the fuck around. Oh, wait, that's it. Finn, what do you smell, girl? Is there something worth checking out up there? Follow Finn. What you tracking, girl? Oh, Finn, get out of there! Oh my god. <sighs> Previous owners warned us. But hey, you followed your nose, and it could have been something amazing. We'll try could it have. sometime. Wasn't. Well, I worked up an appetite. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on my hunger when I venture off. Let's get back out there. Alrighty, we are back. I have to pause for a little bit, because I did have a class. I was playing this in between classes. I was that excited. Let's get back into it. Help this time, Finn, but I trust what you can find. All right, can we send it over the hill here? Ooh, saw the forest. They're really just going on their own. I think we're going the wrong way, boys. No, that's a marker, man. I don't want to go by. Okay, whatever. Oh, no, we're going the right way. Are, are we? Oh, I'm so confused right now. Why are they going on their own? Damn, I'm confused. 
All right, I'm it's plugging in the controller. It's here. What should we do? See, that works. Everything works, but it just instantly tilts to the side. Check it out. Hey, Pops, oh, shit. Nice and quiet. Let's see if it'll come closer. Nope, that's the opposite of what I wanted. True. Fine, let's leave. There's bears down right. Let's go left. Ha! Rabbit's supposed to be a delicacy. What do you think, pups? Hunt it. Okay. We should be able to make this shot. I feel like I've seen this before. <laughs> That's the cutest fucking thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Wait, what am I? Wait, That's interesting. We survive out here. You'll make for a good meal. That was worth it. Was it? Another Just a meal bullet. ready to go. Oh, that's a, Might be time a lot of meal. meat. It is actually. Chomper, is it a battle roll? Yes. We uh, set up a pretty good camp. We've got our meat all strung up to be out of reach of bears. And we mm -hmm. can make a fire. It'll be nice to cook up some food or warm my bones. And of course, I can check on all of you. You can use me filling your hunger meter. You can use a dog bowl to feed your dogs, filling their energy. And you can sleep or strong max maximum capacity lost by being tired. Paw, gers. Fire would be nice. It would. Okay, just a little birch bark, a little spark, and behold, fire. Nice. I'm ready to cook some food. Let's, uh, let's do two. I go to sleep. Eat some food. How do I? Wait, the, there. Food time. Feed dogs. Chow down, pups. Ooh, yikes. We need a lot of meat. Oh, fuck it. Let's use both. Let's uh, get let's back get back on, back the, on trail. the trail. Yeah. Let's get back out there. Let's run it. I was thinking of sleeping, but we don't really need to refill our meter since uh, since we can't fill them up all the way anyway. So let's just keep going. I become tired. While tired, the capacity of your hunger and your dog's energy meters is reduced. You can sleep at camp to remove this effect. Okay. Oh, I take back what I said. What is that, a fox? Can you actually find food like that? I want to see if you can pull this off. And to think it just knows how to do this. It just knows how to survive. We could all be so lucky. I'm not here. So you just keep going. You knew you were close and you had to push through. Hmm. Well, that and some help from a little luck. I can conquer this too. Thanks for the inspiration. Just push Bloggers. through. And do what you have to do. Got it. <laughs> I should have. Uh, is that a horse? Oh. You're a big fella, aren't you? It's okay, Pops. I got this. Going to haunt it. You're making this feel really personal. We need the meat for our dogs. I can't miss from here. Thanks. 
Thank you for helping us. We got four meat. That is so sad, That's though. A good diversion. And let's go to sleep. To rest. I'm sure my stomach will be Holy, by look at this guy. But the dogs will be energized. Well, should we go to sleep? Yes. Look at that sunrise. I think that's a sunrise. Ran by a river. A little slippery, innit, boys? Oh, hey. A, uh, a little wolf friend. It's okay. You can stay over there. We don't mind. Do we? Mush, mush! <laughs> No. Barkley! We've got to do something. Just stay back, Barkley. It's okay. We've got this. Swing rifle. Get out of here. We did it. Okay, Sit down. Buddy? We got you pretty good. It looks good. Belly rubs first. Nice. Right, you did good, Barkley. Really good. You should think about trying to scare things away before you have to use your teeth sometime. You're pretty intimidating. So let's get back to the sled, okay? I need to try. Barkley's to considering this. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. It's okay. Oh. Get in the sled. You don't need to run right now. We need to pet Fen. So she you finds some good there. shit. I don't mind you found a skunk. I trust you, Finn. You can trust me. Facts. Well, you still smell a little. Nice. Stelton. You keeping a lookout for all of us? Cute. Yeah, I don't want to distract you too much, but I think it's time for some good old pets. Maybe some of these. <laughs> and a bit of a scratch here. All right, let's see if we can find something for the vol wolves to hunt. Dogs. Pick it out. I don't want to find out who this belonged to, but we'll take what we can find. Why would we take this? A bullet will do just fine. Ooh, a bullet. That's why we would. Did he dig up a... Did you take my beanie? Oh, no, he took it. It kind of looks like you did. Are you comforted by my scent? Because I think you're thinking about being my friend. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, I'll need that hat back before we go running, but you can keep it for now. Oh, There's a squirrel. A squirrel. Please don't see it, Chomper. I know you love them, but just try to ignore it. He sees it. Send it, Chomper. See, he's just living his life. Uh, he seems unperturbed by us pups. Chomper, you, on the other hand, seem very perturbed. Is this your nemesis? Wait, did it just wink? This is his nemesis. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. What? Chomper, you downed it in one gulp. Okay, fine. I'm proud of you. Now let's take that full belly back on the trail. Come on. <laughs> oh, we need to camp. Like real bad, but we don't have wood. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. And that's a checkpoint. There's so many tree stumps over there. <gasps> oh my god, that is pog. I'd feel a lot more comfortable if it didn't just feel like people disappeared here. Well, there's an axe here. I am just going to uh, take this. And get some wood, preferably. We can feed our dogs or else we lose. I don't think they'll mind. Is this really where I want to be living? This place where people just like disappear and then someone comes along and just takes your axe. Well, should I try this out? Seems yes. Like plenty of birch here. Ooh, collect the birch with axe. Yes, sir. That's so much easier than ripping this off by hand. Looks like we're done imagine. here. Imagine. Oh. Really? Don't worry about it, Chomper. I'll make the decision. 
You just wait for what I decide. You're not gonna wait, are you? Chomper's not waiting. Come on, squirrel. You can't win this. Just get out of here. Oh, hey, don't go. We don't need food. Any harm. Okay, just leave it alone, Chomper. Wait. Ah! Flapped. Oh, Barkley! You know, you don't have to protect me from everything. I could probably handle a squirrel bite. I can't have you endangering yourself to save me. And yeah, I know that was just a squirrel, but they're not always going to be squirrels. Remember the wolf? He almost got you, buddy. You're quick to jump into a fight, no matter the odds. But you've got a bark that just might be meaner than your bite. You might try True. using that first someday. You want to go right. practice? You got to stand up. We got to get this in from our gut. Up. Good boy. Now, speak. <laughs> okay, how about, um... <laughs> yes, yeah, see, you got it. Okay, let's try it again. Bark. <laughs> yes, good boy, Barkley. I think you got bark. this. I know you don't like to use it, but trust me, it'll come in handy. Hey, where'd that squirrel go? You ate it, didn't you, Chomper? All right, you heathen. Let's get back to the trail, pups. Ah, this is amazing. Bullets. That's just what we needed. No, dude, we need wood. Thanks for waiting, pups. Oh, I don't know why it went Five there, man. Left. Yeah, right. what are we going to do with those? We can't get past that checkpoint. That's it. We're done. We don't have any meat either. GG's. I'm, um, I'm feeling a little weak, pups. We're okay. We're all okay. I couldn't find any food. I'll do better when we're actually out there. It's okay. They were just nightmares. It's not gonna happen to us. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for the first episode of the Red Lantern. I'm definitely gonna do more, try to get to the actual Red Lantern. Um, this has been fun. A few bugs there and there, but doesn't really ruin the overall experience. I enjoyed, I enjoyed the gameplay. Um, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.